My name is Grace, and today I'm going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is A Harry Tale, Samson. Let's read. Again, pe God's people disobeyed them, so God let the Palestines rule over them for 40 years. Then he chose a man named Samson to set them free. So, God's people disobeyed God, so God let Palestines rule over them. And God sent Samson. <coughs> To send them free. <laughs> An angel promised Samson's mother that she would have a son. Samson would have uh, have to make strict promise to God, never drink wine, never touch that things, never cut his hair. So an angel promised Samson's mother that she will have a son. And there was a strict promise, never drink wine, never touch that things, and never cut his hair. God made Samson very strong. He killed a lion, EMB, made honey in its body. Samson touched the dead lion, breaking one of the one of God's uh, one of his promise to God. He even ate the honey. So God made Samson very strong, and he killed a lion. And bees made honey. And Samson touched the dead lion and ate the honey. He broken the promise to God. The sky turned black, gray. Christian, Samson had promised to God that he would never drink wine, cut his hair, or touch dead things. True. Samson fell in love with a woman named Darila. The Palestines promised her a lots of money. If she found out why Samson was so strong, she asked him again and again. So Samson fell in love with a woman named Darla. She's Palestine, and the Palestine soldiers <laughs> promised her that if she get, mm, tells his promise, then they will give many money. So Darla asked Samson the prom I mean, <laughs> the reason that he was so strong. <laughs> Finally, Samson told Darla her, his secret. In my hair, uh, if my hair is cut, my strength will go. So while he slept, Darla called for a man to cut off his hair. Samson's strength left them. So finally, Samson told Darla his secret that if you cut my hair, my strength will go. And when Samson was sleeping, Jerla cut his hair. <laughs> Whoa! 
When the Palestines arrived, they captured them easily. They blinded him, then they put him in prison and sent him to work, dragging a heavy grinding stone. So when the Palestines arrived, they captured him very easily and they blinded him and they sent him to work, dragging the heavy grinding stone. Heavy grinding stone. Question: Who convinced Samson to tell his secret and disobey God by having his hair cut? Sorry, it was my mother. Number one, there were a lot. The Palestine soldiers and Samson's mother. Number one, there were a lot was the correct answer. Slowly, Samson's hair grew back. The Palestines brought Samson into their temple to thank their false god, Yagon, for defeating him. Samson asked God to make him strong one last time. So slowly, Samson's hair grew back, and the Palestines brought him into their temple to dance the false god Gavin. And Samson prayed to God that please give me one last, please give me the strength one last time. Between two pillars and pushed on them. The temple fell down, killing all the Palestines and Samson with them. Samson didn't keep his promise, but God kept his. So Samson stood between the two pillars and he prayed, and God gave him the strength. Samson didn't keep his promise, but God kept his. Did God make Samson strong again so that his people would be free from the Palestines? True. Yesterday I read the Bible story. Did you enjoy the next time I'll read another good story? Then let's see you next time. Bye!